Hey guys, what's up? It's your Sunny Trainer, Sydney, and today I have a functional dumbbell workout for you guys. So for this workout, I'm gonna be using five pound dumbbells, but you're welcome to use whatever is perfect for your fitness level. If I was doing this workout at home, I would probably use 10 pound dumbbells or heavier, but since I'm gonna be instructing you through it, I chose something a little lighter. So whatever works for you for these movements, the movements that we're gonna be doing today are a little more complex than just your average squat or deadlift. We're gonna be adding extra movements in to target other muscles in our body as we work. So you might wanna pick something a little lighter than you normally use when you're working out at the gym. All right, so we're gonna to start today with two different exercises. We're gonna do 10 reps of each and then we'll have the 60 second rest in between sets. We'll be doing each exercise three total times. All right, so let's get started. Our first exercise today is deadlift rows. So we are gonna be dipping it down into a deadlift. Your back should be staying nice and straight. You should just be hinging at the hips and the knees. Then we're gonna bring it on up into a row. So deadlift, drop it down, bring it up, and row. All right, we're gonna do 10 of those, so let's do it. One. Two. Three. Four. Great job. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Last one. Great job, shake it out really quick. We're gonna go right into the next exercise. So our next exercise is a full body swing. So kind of like a kettlebell swing, except we're gonna be taking the dumbbells from all the way at the bottom to all the way overhead. All right, so we have 10 total. So nice, low squat, and swing those dumbbells up overhead. That's one. Two, three, nice and controlled. Four, keep those abs engaged as you swing those dumbbells. Six, seven, three more. Last one. Awesome job, let's drop those dumbbells. We're gonna rest for 60 seconds. So grab some water, catch your breath. We'll get right back into it with those same two exercises, set number two. back to normal before we start our next set. About 15 more seconds. All right, 10 more seconds. So grab those dumbbells. We're gonna get right back into it with deadlift rows. Ready? Three, two, one, let's go. Nice deadlift row. Squeeze those shoulder blades in the back, the top of that row. Good job. Three, four, five, five more. Doing awesome, stay strong. Nine, last one, and 10. All right, right into our next exercise, full body swing, we have 10. Squat it nice and low, keep those abs engaged all the way through the swing. Great job. 
four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, last one, and 10. Woo! Great work. Another 60 second rest. Awesome job, you guys. Like last time, grab a sip of water, catch your breath, shake out the body, give you a full 60 seconds to rest. So we have one more set of our deadlift throws and full body swing, and then we're gonna take a two minute rest. So you're gonna get even extra rest before we move on to our next set of two exercises. So if you're getting tired, just know there's more rest on the way. All right, 15 more seconds. Great job, you guys. Let's get ready for that next set. Our very last set of these two exercises. Let's get started. Deadlift rows in three, two, one. One. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, last one, ten. Awesome job. Full body swing. Ten total reps. Let's go. One. Two, three, four, five, halfway there, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job, you guys. Put those dumbbells down. Let's rest. We have two total minutes of rest. So really soak it in. You wanna go lay on the couch. Whatever you wanna do, feel free. Catch my breath. Definitely grab a sip of water if you have it on hand. This is definitely the time to do that. Great job, you guys. If this is really tiring tiring you out, excuse me, that's totally normal. These exercises are pretty challenging, you know? They're combining big compound lifts that already work a lot of muscles in your body at once, and we're adding on additional movements to those. So you're really working a lot of the muscles in your body at once during these exercises. So definitely give yourself a pat on the back. These are definitely advanced movements that are going to take some time to get used to. So, you're doing great. About one more minute left. Alright, so before we get started, while you guys are still resting, I'm going to quickly show you the next two exercises so that we can kind of just get right into it. So, the first exercise is a squat hold with overhead raise. This one seriously burns, so we are just going to be holding it down in the squat and we're gonna be lifting the dumbbells like this. Staying right in that squat as low as you possibly can. Okay, so that's the first exercise. The next one is a back lunge with overhead press. So we're gonna keep those dumbbells right at shoulder height, back lunge, and press it up overhead. And we're gonna be alternating legs. So only five on each side, so not too bad. Okay. 15 more seconds and we're gonna get started. So get ready, fix your hair if you need to, like me. <laughs> Last sip of water, let's grab those dumbbells. 
and get going. Okay, squat hold with overhead raise. We're coming for you in three, two, one. Nice squat hold. We're gonna raise those dumbbells overhead 10 total times. Nice and controlled. Five. Trying to stay nice and low in that squat. Nine. And 10. Woo! Great job, you guys. Come on up and out of that squat. Oh man, shake out the legs. Okay, next up, back lunge with an overhead press. So nice back lunge. Both this front leg and back leg should be right in a 90 degree angle. Come on up. Press those dumbbells up overhead. That's one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Last one. And ten. Woo! Great job. All right, one minute of rest. Once again, soak it in. Enjoy it while it's here. Catch your breath. Get ready for another round. Only two more rounds left. I know it's starting to get tough. We're really using all of those muscles. But stay strong. Two more sets left of each exercise and we'll be done for the day. You guys are doing so great. 15 more seconds. Grab these dumbbells. All right, set number two. Let's get started. A squat hold with overhead raise. In three, two, and one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Stay low. Seven. Eight. Nine. And ten. Great job. Shake it out. Oh my gosh, my legs are burning. All right, back lunge with overhead press. Let's do it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine and ten. Woo! Round two done. One more round left. Great job, you guys. You're doing amazing. So close. Sixty second rest. Soak it in. Grab a sip of water. Let's get ready for this last round. So close, we got this. Nice deep breaths. All right, we've got about 15 more seconds, so head back to your little workout space. Let's get set up and ready to go. Grab those dumbbells. All right, you guys know what's up. Squat holds with overhead raise. Okay, let's get started. In three, two, one, let's go. 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Whew. I kind of cheated on that last one. Woo! Close enough. Okay, next up, back ones and overhead press. We have ten total. Let's do it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Woo! Yes, we did it. I'm so proud of you guys. All right, shake out those arms, those legs. Let's do a quick stretch because I know that was a lot. So nice forward fold. With a nice gentle rock side to side. Nice. Gentle breathing, let's bring that breathing down. All right, come on down to your knees. We're gonna do a quick back extension stretch. So bring it on forward. Hands are just slightly out in front of you. And looking up towards the sky. workout. What an awesome workout. You guys did an amazing job. We'll see you guys next time.